What are some of the things that, that have come to mind to you as someone who monitors not only Charlotte government, but also aviation issues about what people should know about this whole mess? It's a weird inside, inside, inside Charlotte politics story, but it's a good reminder to local governments everywhere that effective oversight matters and how easy it is for someone to develop over decades a large amount of respect and power to where their actions become unquestioned, where effectively you don't have oversight in practice, even if you think you have it on paper. I mean, Charlotte had an airport advisory board, but it was somewhere between a rubber stamp and a cheering section. And then Charlotte City Council wasn't much better. And things went on like that for years and years and years. And then all of a sudden, something happens. The city council feels that it needs to exercise more control over the airport. And then you have a, poor, a powerful airport director who's well-connected politically, well-respected, whose friends say, well, maybe the city shouldn't be in charge of the airport anymore. So the way to avoid those sorts of situations is to have good, effective oversight throughout. Ask hard questions, and you can avoid these sorts of situations, hopefully.